when prime minister narendra modi ji became prime minister he understood that if i don't utilize this time and if i allow this time to pass this country will never be a developed nation this country will never come out of poverty this country will never be able to employ its human resource and realizing that realizing this potential of our country honorable prime minister narendra modi ji started skill development ministry now why it is important because globally if we see the job market has totally changed today you may be a degree holder but you may not get a job unless you have skills there are many commerce graduate today after gst when i talk to my friends who are chartered accountants they say we require huge manpower but then i say there are so many commerce graduate why don't you employ them he says they are unemployable they may possess a degree but they don't have skill of accounting so this is where the entire job market has changed and today the one who possesses skill is more job seeker than the one who possesses a mere degree and realizing that our honorable prime minister started skill development ministry and entire country was surveyed vis a vis the skill market and based on that the skill sectors were finalized and the skill development started skilling started today if you go to any industry and if you ask any industrialist what is your problem he says i have a good industry i have a good market but i don't have skilled manpower and if you ask a youth what is your problem the youth says that i don't have job i am a jobless so this is a disconnect between the job market and the youth and this disconnect can be bridged through skill development and that is what is understood and not just india but understand that 2020 when india became the most youthful country of the world in a same year the demographics of other countries started changing so in years to come the demography or the median age of eastern europe will be 44 years the median age of western europe 41 years the median age of america 37 years the median age of japan 45 years the median age of china 39 years so entire developed world is aging the entire developed world requires human resource to fuel their economy to run their industries to run their businesses because they have now a reverse ratio there are more dependents there are more elderly people in these economies who cannot work for those economies who cannot earn for themselves the country has to earn for them and for that the country requires a human resource now this global human resource is available only with india if india transforms its human resource or its population into human resource we can give human resource to entire world and that is what is realized by honorable prime minister and through skill development and through nep the new education policy